Hey, what's up everyone? For those that are new to the channel, my name is Hunter and currently I'm in Madrid, Spain and I'm here for just a semester for school uh, but I'm from the US. As uh, you can see, I just went to a shop called Taste of America because it's impossible to get peanut butter here and I really wanted peanut butter and jelly sandwiches because a lot of the food I don't even like really so that's uh, something normal that I had to get. In today's video, I was going to go around and show you some of the different cars that they have in Europe compared to the US because there's a lot of different ones that I've never seen before, like different brands. So I thought I was just going to walk around the town and just show you some of the different cars that we have here compared in the US. So this first car is actually kind of weird. It's from South Korea. It's called Daewoo. And I don't know why it's in Spain, but the company actually closed about uh, 10 years ago, or 15 years ago, I think, and they sold out to GM. So now they think it's just GM South Korea that the company is now. There's no longer Daewoo, but I'll show you guys the car. And like a lot of these cars here, none of them are really that cool looking. There's kind of like regular transport cars, but uh, there are some that are supposed to be nicer. But I think uh, there's nothing like, nothing Lamborghini level or any supercars. It's just uh, regular cars that people drive here. So this next car is actually one of the more common ones. It's, um, it's called a Renault. This is one of the more popular cars in Spain and throughout Europe. It is manufactured in France and it's on the lower end of cars. It's one of the cheaper ones, but they are very common and there's a lot of different models for all of these. Like for example, here's another one. As you'll notice, they have a lot of the wagon type of vehicles. So this vehicle is a little bit uh, nicer compared to the other ones. It is Skoda and it is manufactured and designed in Czech. This is least common here in Spain and throughout Europe. Uh, it might be more popular in other places, but I know through a lot of um, like France, Germany, Switzerland, uh, Italy. So this car is actually manufactured in Spain. It's called a Seat, S-E-A-T. One of the more normal cars. It's not that, I mean, it's kind of common here. So the next one is called Citrochen, uh, something like that. It's a French vehicle, and those are one of the most common, I think. Like, let's see. All right, there's a Rover, Range Rover, this car. Um, Ford, Ford. Okay, right as I say, it's one of the most common. It's not even here. Um, gonna get hit by a car. Uh, and let's see, yeah, and here we go. Here's another one, so I mean, it's somewhat common. Oh, here it is again. Okay, so you can see that's one of the common vehicles here. So this next car is called Pugot. Pugot, excuse my French, it's a French car, but this is considered to be one of the nicer cars here. I um, actually had a friend from the area here tell me that this was similar to like an Audi or a BMW. That, I'm not so sure, like, he told me that, I, I don't feel like I can believe that completely. I have been in one before, and it was pretty nice, but uh, it's not that nice, and I feel for the price, it doesn't seem like an Audi, and they're pretty common. So that's all I'm gonna show you today. There are a lot more here. Uh, those are just some of the more common ones, but I am missing a lot still. There's a lot of different type of cars here. If you have any questions or if you want to know anything, leave them in the comments below. Or else if you want to like and subscribe, that'd be great. Thanks for watching. Bye.